Hi guys, Dr. Jim Wright here. Today we're going to be talking about dental dam placement for a mercury removal procedure. This is the placement of the clamp. I have the clamp in my hand with the holder or the placement instrument. The assistant, very importantly, is relieving and retracting her tongue, and I also am relieving the, the cheek tissue and really carefully looking in there. You could see I wear microscopic loops. I want to make sure that I'm not pinching anything as I place that clamp. We like to place floss on the back of the clamp for security purposes. I'm going to pull the floss through. We like to punch a hole in the middle of the dam and then put a little bit of pressure to open that hole. And you want to go up and over the back of that loop. And then you want to get that underneath the little wings. The one's on the buckle, one's on the lingual. Use an instrument of choice. A flat end instrument is great to just push that dam underneath the, the wing of that clamp. And we like to use a non-latex dental dam. Next, we're going to place our frame. So you want to take the dam and place it over the edges of the frame. The patient is securing her nose mask to make sure that everything is secure for her. We're then going to loop the floss around the middle prong that's sticking out so that it doesn't go anywhere. We'll finish by securing the frame to the dam and we're done.